So we finally made it to Stockholm and it's very cold. It's a little wet, but it looks awesome. It looks metal. It looks very metal. <laughs> Now we're gonna walk into the uh, central station of their subway systems because apparently they're pretty awesome. And there's coffee there. So we're gonna go check it out. Oop, got something on my lens. What's up with these weird crows that have like different colors on them than regular crows? really some beautiful buildings here. Old stuff. <laughs> We're very excited. We have a backdrop. Doesn't it look impressive? Doesn't it look so impressive like that? <laughs> I'll definitely have some pictures later on when we get it up and everything, but it's pretty exciting. We finally got our backdrop up. Yeah, buddy. Might as well take a freaking drum kit. Yeah, if there wasn't a big drum kit in the way. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have a Steve cam. Now, one day I hope to be able to have a dressing room like this. You'll see they have some really nice catering, have bottles of wine, candy, yeah, yeah, and that's one of their dressing rooms. <laughs> you want to see my dressing room? Okay, hold on. This is our dressing room. Oh, I'm changing! Oh, no. <laughs> but if you see, if you get in like this, yeah. If you look real closely, we do have a name. But, the good thing about a dressing room, it encompasses catering. It does, we're close to catering. So, <laughs> at least that that's good. Beautiful scenery and we get to watch the Pro sound check every night. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> Super legit catering again. Smoked salmon, beef, all this yummy stuff. Oh, I heard that one. <laughs> so, what's the secret to getting a voice like Steve Bronze? Bum luck. That's right, some green tea. <laughs> Water in a tea bag. And some honey. <laughs> so Paul's gonna introduce us tonight when we go on stage in Stockholm. Yeah. What's your name again? That was awesome. <laughs> hey Soko. Yeah. From Saxon's American to him. We give you the Hunter Award winning Halcyon Wayne. Yeah. <laughs> so, how do you think the show went today, man? Pretty cool show. I mean, it was great to play Stockholm. Very iconic city. <laughs> what do you think? What do I think? <laughs> no, I think the, the camera on you. <laughs> I think the show went good. Um, I wouldn't say they were necessarily a hard crowd, they were a reserved crowd, kind of like Germany where they may have enjoyed it but they wouldn't really get super into it, but towards the end I feel we won them over and they were chanting and throwing their hands up, so overall it's, you know, I think our first time in Sweden went really well. Stockholm has just been really cool in general, we walked around the city for a while and uh, it's just a really cool atmosphere and everything. I can totally see why so many awesome metal bands come out of this, you know, very atmospheric environment, you know, it's it's very awesome, very cool city. Sweden has won my heart over totally. Look at what the venue just gave us. It gave us a One whole large cheese pizza, pizza. just uh, uh, 
yummy. And this piece is mine. <laughs> it's all it's all one piece. It's, all one piece. <laughs> uh, it's seriously awesome though. They've been super super nice here in Sweden. I love it. That's one thing I'd like to say too is just thank you so much to everybody that's been watching the vlogs on. And I love how much everybody's been uh, commenting on them and sharing them and everything. Um, I know it's really not like I'm getting tons of views, but it's still really awesome for me that people are enjoying them as much as they are. So uh, thank you very much to everybody that's been supporting me with it. So we made it here into Gothenburg for our second show in Sweden. We're at the Trodgarn, I guess is how you say it. It's a very cool venue. They have a bunch of pictures on the walls of all the different bands that have played here and a lot of really cool bands. And so just to kind of continue along with some of the problems we've been having, we uh, left a box of our supplies that had like picks and strings and tools and stuff like that. Looks like we left it at the venue in Stockholm. So, kind of sucks, but whatever. We're in, a, we're in a big awesome candy store. And oh my god, they have plop. I wonder if they have Swedish fish here. Inconceivable. This all looks so good. Is it like cola flavor or something? Probably. Try one. <laughs> oh. Try one. <laughs> we found a boat. Kind of a random place for a uh, skateboard ramp. And drop in. So since the tour has been going so well for us and we've been so profitable, we've uh, decided to do a little car shopping. I don't know. I think we do better. I think that's a new Civic. Here's our backdrop a little closer. How excited are you about playing tonight, Steve? <laughs> How excited are you tonight to play, Ernie? Woohoo! <laughs> I don't know. That's How excited are you for us to play tonight, Frank? Very. Hey, John? Hey, John. How excited are you to play tonight? Oh. <laughs> 